Hi everyone, welcome to Fine Wine of the Old World. Today I would like to talk to you about Merlot. I hope you watched the previous video, which is about the Cabernet Sauvignon. If you haven't done it yet, please do, because I think they're slightly interconnecting and I think it would be good if you watch the other video as well. Merlot is quite famous and people normally know a bit more um, about Merlot or novel grapes, but I still hope you will learn something new today and I hope you enjoy the video. I think it would be very, very interesting for you to find out what Merlot in French means and that means the blackbird. And I don't know because of the colour of the bird or because the bird loved Merlot grapes. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe you know, then please leave a comment. When it comes to the other names, I didn't find plenty, but I know there is one which is um, Picard. Um, but usually you would find the Merlot and the Merlot name. Why I want you to watch the previous video, which is Cabernet Sauvignon, is because I am again sh showing the same bottle. And this bottle was used because um, it is the same quantity of the Cabernet Sauvignon and Merlot in this blend. I wanted to limit drinking, <laughs> so yeah, so um, we are saving up on wine as well, so yeah. <laughs> um, anyway, the Merlot grape is very often grown in Medoc region and that's why the bottle and this is the left bank of the river and therefore you can definitely find it there as a part of a blend. So please always remember Medoc, Merlot and Cabernet Sauvignon. And like Cabernet Sauvignon, Merlot prefers the clay or the limestone based soils and that's because they're normally cooler and that's why the grape normally ripens slowly and that's why when it comes to the wine characteristics you'll find that Merlot can be in different variety of notes and you can um, have it as a very light body wine or you can have it as um, Cabernet Sauvignon, very heavy. So it all depends on of the winemaker, of the um, region, of the, of the soil and all together can make the wine um, so different to one another. Very often Merlot has the red fruit, which is going to be raspberries, strawberries, um, but also when it comes to the a little bit warmer region, you can find the plum, you can find the blackberry. And for example, if you find that wine from Medoc, um, that is going to be very heavy, very smoky wine, medium acidity, and also the tannins are a bit sharper. And then when it comes to the other styles, you can find the um, Merlot as a light body wine, as I said, uh, but you can also find it medium body. So yeah, Merlot is very expressive <laughs> and is, um, yeah, you can always um, find something very interesting. And outside of France, you can find Merlot in Italy and where it's um, mixed with, for example, Sangiovese and that's very similar blend to our Bordeaux blend and you can also find it outside Italy, which is uh, Moldova, Slovenia, um, Switzerland and uh, other countries. And I also wanted to mention that I really liked White Merlot and you can see it on the Instagram uh, how I served it. But uh, White Merlot can have something sometimes this strawberry notes and I really, really, really like the White Merlot and I really um, recommend you having and trying one. Aging of the Merlot, I would say around probably five years, it would be the safest. And when it comes to the food, I would always recommend you having something fatty and um, high in protein. So for me, the Merlot, blue cheese, perfect. And then also the steak. Um, so um, definitely a lot of different foods to be paired with Merlot. Well, this is it for today. I hope you enjoyed the video and I hope you drink responsibly. And I wish you a great day, great evening and a great... Hmm blend in your glass. Bye!